Hello and welcome to Advanced Convolutional Neural Networks, Deep Learning in Python, Part 9. This is one of the most exciting courses I've done, and it really shows how fast and how far deep learning has come over the years. When I first started my deep learning series, I didn't ever consider that I'd make two courses on convolutional nets. But I think what you'll find is that this course is so entirely different from the previous one, you'll be impressed at just how much material we have to cover. And as massive as this course is, I still have more ideas that I want to add as updates in the future. So let me give you a quick rundown of what this course is all about. First, we're going to bridge the gap between the basic CNN architecture you already know and love to modern, novel architectures such as VGG, ResNet, and Inception, which, as you might have guessed, is named after the movie. We're going to apply these to images of blood cells and create a system that is a better medical expert than either you or I. That's a pretty neat idea if you think about it, that the doctors of the future are not humans, but robots. Second, one of the major themes of this course is that we're moving away from the CNN itself to systems involving CNNs. So what do I mean by that? Well, a CNN does one basic thing, image classification. In this course, you'll see how we can turn a CNN into an object detection system that not only classifies images, but can locate each object in an image and predict its label. You can imagine that such a task is a basic prerequisite for self-driving vehicles. We'll be looking at a state-of-the-art algorithm called SSD. Another very popular computer vision task that makes use of CNNs is called neural style transfer. This is where you take one image called the content image and another image called the style image and you combine these to make an entirely new image that is as if you hired a painter to paint the content of the first image with the style of the other. Unlike a human painter, this can be done in a matter of seconds. I hope you're excited to learn about these advanced applications of CNNs. I'll see you in class.